first let us write what has been given on the question and then we'll be finding whether or not we can equate any of the equations to solve it further so as the first step we are going to write the things written given by the question so here we can write x cos alpha plus y sine alpha equals to k and we call it equation one similarly x cos beta plus y sine beta equals to k we call it equation two so since equation one and equation two are k then we can write then we can write x cos alpha plus y sine alpha equal to x cos beta plus y sine beta because both are equivalent to k or no, we can write x cos alpha minus x cos beta we got it before the equal to equals to y sine beta minus y sine alpha so we rearrange the term now we can take x common so after taking x common we'll have cos alpha minus cos beta in the left hand side we have taken x common now in the right hand side we'll take y common so we'll have sine beta minus sine alpha okay since we are going to find the value of x so we'll put x alone before the equals to so we we'll write x equals to y sine beta minus sine alpha over cos alpha minus cos beta now you can apply the formula of sine c minus sine d in the numerator and the formula of sine c minus sine d in the numerator will be as 2 cos beta plus alpha by 2 dot sine beta minus alpha by 2 so we operate the formula of sine c minus sine d in the numerator and now we can also apply the formula of cos c minus cos in the denominator the formula will be as 2 sine alpha plus beta by 2 dot we also have y left here we forgot writing y here so y will also be written sine beta minus alpha by 2 so we can cancel sine beta minus alpha by 2 we can also cancel 2 and 2 now let's see what we have after this so we'll have x equals to x equals to y cos beta plus alpha by 2 and sine by sine alpha plus beta by 2 is cot alpha plus beta by 2 so this is how we prove the given question it's easy to do and to